Welcome everyone to a new FIFA 22 tactics video on my channel. My name is Mark and in this video I'm going to show you the best way to play with the English club Liverpool. All in my opinion of course and at this moment in the game. I'm going to show you best formation lineup tactics and instructions first really quick. So you can take that uh, and yeah try it out yourself if you want. And after that part I'm going to go in more in depth to the tactics why i'm making these choices and i'm gonna show you also some gameplay like the goals that you are seeing and explaining why i think this formation is really good uh, but before i begin i really wanted to ask you to drop a like under the video it will be really helpful for me and my channel to grow and help my videos right uh, hang right uh, higher on youtube sorry um so if you like then uh, i will really appreciate it and if you are new to the channel i want to find your way back really easy make sure you are subscribed with notifications on uh, the formation that we are playing is the default formation at least at the moment that i was recording this video in it's the three one four two formation and we are going to change a little bit uh, of course and that's all because i like to play that way um i need to say that this formation is really really attacking especially the way how i uh, play it but i like to play really attacking football uh, especially in online seasons so um yeah if it's too attacking for you maybe it takes some time to learn to uh, this way to play yourself i'm used to play the 3-5-2 formation a lot so i'm used to play with three defenders with three center backs if you're not, not used to that maybe it takes some practice to get used to it or else maybe you could try out one of the other Liverpool videos that I made in the past. All right, uh, we're gonna change a few things here. Uh, Gomez, Konate and Van Dijk are the center backs and I'm gonna say something about that later because um, Konate, especially Konate, is a bit too slow i played with him in the match that i was playing but for my feeling he was a bit too slow gomez and van dyke are okay and i realized well maybe you can uh take out konate uh replace him by diaz and then play robertson as a center back and diaz as the left midfielder so if you want to do that feel free to do that um just we're going a bit back because i didn't show you all the other players well allison is the goalkeeper of course so gomez konate and van dyke are the center backs i'm using fabinho as the central defensive midfielder Roberto Firmino and Jota as the central midfielders and I know these guys are not central midfielders but they can play there especially the way how I'm playing this formation um, they are doing a really great job um, Trent Alexander-Arnold and Robertson on the right and on the left side and I'm using Salah and Mane as the strikers uh, then we're going to the tactics its defensive style is on pressure on heavy touch the width 35 the depth we are changing a bit to 50. The builder play is on a long ball, chance creation on direct passing. The width a bit lower, it's on 45. Players in the box, just five bars, corners of free kicks, both one bar. Uh, then we're going to the instructions for the striker, Mane, stay central and get in behind. Uh, Salah, uh, balanced. And getting behind sorry for Mane also balanced and getting behind so both balanced and getting behind uh, and then we have Trent Alexander-Arnold come back on the fence stay wide get in behind and get into the box for the cross the same for Robertson come back on the fence stay wide get in behind and get into the box for the cross and uh, then we're going to the central midfielders I play both the same and we're doing get forward and cover center Firmino the same get forward uh, and cover center so that is really really attacking because both are going forward if you think that is a bit too much too attacking for you you can do one on balanced or maybe two on balanced or you can even put both um stay back while attacking that will also work but it's less attacking than when you 
put them uh, both on cast forward, but you can put them both also on stay back while attacking if this is too attacking for you. Then we have Fabinho, good passing lane, stay back while attacking and cover center and all the center backs are just default. All right, um, then we have Wallace Allison. You, yeah, it doesn't matter for the tactic that much, but with this keeper, come for crosses and sweeper keeper is working really good. All right, this is the end of this part of the video. Now I'm gonna show you uh, some gameplay and some examples why I think this formation is really good. So if you don't wanna see that, feel free to leave now, of course. Thank you very much for watching. And then we're going to the part, next part of this video. And here you can see we are from the kickoff I was losing the ball, but recover it really, really quick. Um, this was in Division 2, I need to say. Uh, I'm between Division 2 and Division 1 uh, all the time because I'm trying out new tactics and that will result in losses as well. Uh, so that's why I'm sometimes I, uh, yeah, I'm going down to Division 2, but I don't think it doesn't matter that much. And we're scoring here the first goal from the kickoff. And then you can see how really much people there are in front when you are attacking here we are on the right side with trent alexander arnold the right and the left uh, midfielder are really important so you can see we have salah in the middle we have Mane in the middle and here we have firmino and yeah this is uh, robertson um so you can choose what you are going to do in this scenario i was just going back passing the ball to jota and uh, to, to firmino he usually also Jota going into the box, then we're going around the defense, just going into the box, there is Jota and he can score, a bit luck that the ball was being touched by a defender, but we are scoring and then you can see how really attacking this football is. All right, this is a uh, goal that I get against, this pass was a mistake from me and then you can see also a bit of the weakness from this formation i also want to show you that with you guys and you can see especially we are playing against paris saint germain of course they have messi they have neymar and Mbappe, di maria uh, especially Mbappe and neymar are really really fast and you are playing with only three defenders so i was making another mistake with van dijk at this moment i was a bit too confident with the defending so Van Dijk needs to go after Messi, but he is never going to catch up. We have Fabinho, who is also not the most fast midfielder. So I was doubting about switching to Fabinho and try to catch up with Messi or switching to Konate and then catch up with Messi. But that is the most dangerous uh, choice because then you have two people wide open. But at that moment, I... I thought, well, this opponent is not really good at this moment. So I choose to go with Konate and hopefully to uh, yeah, intercept the ball. But he is making a really good lob pass. And yeah, he's able to score. A bit lucky that this volley is going in. But yeah, it was deserved. It was my own mistake. Um, we will never do that again, of course. All right, then we are going from the build-up. We recovered the ball. We have Trent Alexander-Arnold uh, here. As you can see, we have the three center backs. Trent Alexander-Arnold was also back. And here you can see um, Robertson also back. So when everybody is going back, so if it's not a counter-attack, it's a normal build-up play from your opponent, then you are playing with five defenders and also Fabinho just before the defense. So you are playing with six defenders most of the time so that must be enough only the counter attacks are a bit risky but if it's a normal build-up then you don't have that problem all right we are passing the ball to Firmino who was coming into the ball Fabinho was making a bit of a run and then a really great pass and then you can see the strength of this formation the two strikers Salah and Mane really really fast Give him a through ball faster than Sergio Ramos, of course, and Salah. Easy goal to score. Then my opponent is going to attack again. We are trying to defend, and here you can see we have the defenders. Trent Alexander-Arnold is here, Robertson, Van Dijk, Konate. I am Fabinho. Before that, I was this defender. I think this is Gomez, and I switched to Fabinho. So you can see that everybody's going back, and also Firmino and Jota. They have the high, high work rate, so high attacking, high defensive. So they will come back as well. And 
yeah, then you can see that is really, really grouty there and we were able to block the ball and then build up another attack. And it has some kind of counter attack. And then you can see again, the strength of this one. You can see with the forward runs that they are making with the long ball tactics that we are using. Salah is making the run by himself. I didn't need to trigger him, give him a loft and through ball. And this one was really, really wonderful. Exactly enough power and another great goal for Salah. All right, then we're going into the second half. And yeah, I was making a mistake here again with Konate. Here you can see I was switching um, to Konate and sometimes I'm a bit struggling with the direction that they are going. Uh, in this case, he was just turning at the moment that I was switching to him and then, yeah, he just run uh, forward because maybe you wanted to try the offside thing of, or something but before I could change direction of Konate yeah I was gone already and then you can see also the weakness of the slow center backs Konate is not even that slow 79 is not really really slow but too slow to play against Mbappe you can see that here he's not able to catch up anymore and Mbappe can score so it's a bit of my own mistake also a bit unlucky that he was just turning around at the moment that I was switching to him um, but <clears throat> this is a example for me to say well if you uh, have trouble with slow defenders um, put Konate out of the field put him on the bench uh, place Robertson as a center back he's a bit faster and then you can uh, play Diaz as a left midfielder. All right, here we have another attack from my opponent, but Robertson is doing a really, really great job. He can go to attack, go into the box for the cross, doing a fake shot. Jota is there, a bit lucky, uh, unlucky that the ball was blocked, but lucky that we can shoot again. <coughs> and then we have a easy goal. Again, my opponent, uh, he was playing some pressure football, also that uh, is sometimes a bit hard to play the ball around but he is attacking now with Messi Robertson is trying to catch the ball he was making a mistake with the pass Van Dijk with a really good interception and then we have another counter attack with Mane <coughs> there is Salah and there it is an easy easy goal <coughs> sorry my throat I don't know what it is. It's it's for a month now this. Um, but this is the end of this video. Uh, we won 5-2. You can see the players are a bit tired. Only 64 minutes of playing. So at this moment, normally, I would say replace some players uh, like Alexander Arnold, maybe Jota, and maybe one of the strikers. Uh, but that's up to you, of course. <coughs> All right. This is the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.